too long ago, sales and marketing programs were evaluated based on uh, how much sales happened as a result of that program. The traditional KPIs of the funnel, that number of customers who showed interest to number of people who evaluated to actually the people who bought it and who came back to buy it, are possibly today not the only KPIs that organizations are looking at. Because the, cost, because the product may have the right features, may have the right appeal, but I think customers are today looking at something else. It's their experience. It's the conversations that they are having with their influencers. And they are listening to it and imagining how it will be to buy that product. So it's not about only the product, great product sales. It's also about how it is presented, how it is sold, how it is packaged and so on and so forth. I think one is about the way the KPIs are monitored. Today the marketing managers are no more looking at only the traditional funnel of uh, how many clicks and how many click-throughs and what came out of it. They are looking at the customer experience, how uh, the customer is tuning to the voice of the influencers that he or she cares about. So it's a challenge, it's an evolving subject. People are trying to figure out what KPIs will be there on the dashboard to monitor whether the brand is doing well or not. Because the product features and standard traditional methods of uh, measurement and promotion are not going to really indicate the success or failure of the product. Secondly, it's about the method, the process which is deployed. So product may have the right price, it may be available, it may have the right features, it may have the right branding, advertising and so on and so forth. However, if the billing possibly took long or the packaging was not very appealing or maybe the salesperson didn't really understand uh, the customer well, so maybe the sale won't take place at all. So what does a marketing person do as we recruit for organizations? Uh, so these are the changes that we see. So organizations are really looking for the best talent that they can buy from the market in sales and marketing. So if you have the right service orientation, right amount of intellectual bandwidth, right amount of emotional quotient, then you are likely to really understand what the customer is really looking for and empathize with the customer. So I think that's at the recruit that's at the hiring recruitment process. It's also a leadership process which kicks in there. What the leadership team really believes in, how they really interact with customers, uh, customer queries, customer grievances, issues, how they deal with it, what messaging that they do within the organization. And then finally, I think Sam Walton very rightly said that when you are confused, go to the store, you meet the customer who has all the money and all the answers that you are looking at. So truly said, legend. Thank you.